Morning folks, Kevin Whirling Viper back again for another hardware review. And um, this morning we've got the Wizmet Active to look at. It's got a Bluetooth speaker in it. Let's go down and take, and take a look at it, shall we? Cinetech. Here's the box for the Wismec Active. It's a picture on the uh, front there. Right there, you got your TPD flashes on the front there. Right, let's get this thing open, shall we? Oh. Right, it comes in a flat box, as you can see. Black box. There she is, displayed there. Not too bad, actually. Displays okay. Let's take her out, see what other stuff we get with her. <laughs> Additional product information. Maximum refill nozzle dimensions. 3.4 millimeters. Oh, fair enough. Coil guide. You got the tank guide, which is the Armour NS Plus, and then you've got the guide or the manual for the Wismec Actif. In this little box here, we get micro USB cable. You get a, a cab carabiner hook, and you get some O rings for the tank. You actually get two coils that come along with this. You get the pre installed one, which would be the 1.3 mouth to lung and you also get a 0.2 direct to lung coil with it the direct to lung is actually in the tank the other one i've put it down somewhere i don't know where it is not that i would use it as mouth to lung anyway i'm not that type of vapor really these days all right let's just take that off of there there's let's have a quick look around this here and the armor ns pro I have to say it's pretty basic top fill tank. You've got a little mark on here somewhere, if I can find it. There it is there. Push that back like so and fill up through the top there. You've got a 510 drip tip on there. Uh, it's an acrylic drip tip, that's fair enough. You've got an acrylic tank here, so just pull the base off. There's the coil there. As I say, that is the... Um, they call that the WS01. It's a 0.2 direct lung, and it's rated from 40 to 80 watts. The other one is rated 9 to 14 watts, something like that. But anyway, as you can see, let's just pop that back in there a tick. As you can see there, you've got a Cylon activated airflow. Um, it's a stop airflow, so you can put it on whatever you basically like. You've got three little holes inside the airflow, so you can cut it down, yeah, and you can do uh, a very tight mouth to lung draw with it. Right, uh, let's put some liquid in this and get it all set up and whatnot. What shall I use? Oh, I've got pink man here. Make sure that you close that airflow down before you fill this tank up. Otherwise, you might have a little bit of mess come back at you. Who knows? Right. This is a 2 mil tank. Right, put that to one side so that it can uh, soak up some of that. If I can ever find it. There we are. There we go. Right. Pop that there. Before I uh, go on with that, let's tell you a bit more about this tank. The actual diameter of the tank is 25 millimetres. So it's 25 millimetres in, you know, at the base there. Um, increasing to 27 millimetres at the tank, because this is like a bubble type tank. And even though it's a bubble type tank, you can only get 2 mil of liquid in it. With the tank, as I said, the tank comes pre-installed with the 1.3 ohm coil. It will, as, as always, I, I do recommend pre-wicking this coil as I've just done just now, because otherwise, when you when you fire it, you might find that uh, uh, it it burns, which it will render the coil useless anyway. Oh, there you go. Right, let's pop the tank to one side for a minute so that this, the cop can soak that up, and let's uh, take a a look at this here mod, shall we? Right, this is just going to be a quick look around. I think it's powered by a twenty one hundred mAh internal battery, which can be charged at two amps if you want it to be. You know, I usually stick it in via the computer so it gets charged at, uh, at one amp. But there you go. The outer edges of the mod are covered by this rubber stylized cover. 
the centre, the grills are flat. They look like it's got a great, great cheese grater type pattern on there. Uh, you got the speaker inside there. I believe this side is sealed anyway to make it waterproof because this is uh, apparently this is waterproof. Now I haven't tested that out myself, not wanting to spend around the mud sort of thing. Uh, I would imagine it'd be it was okay in the rain the other day when I took it out in the rain, so uh, that's fair enough. Let's, uh, let's just pull this cover off of here, shall we? There we go. There it is. As you can see, the actual action buttons on here are all yellow. They're in a, it's a, a yellow silicon, yeah. Uh, there's your fire button, you've got a little screen there, um, and you've got your up and down. You've also got your USB point, and you've got a reset there. Obviously, that's for when you do your updates. If it screws up, you just pop that and start again, sort of thing, you know. On the reverse side, there you've got now it's pretty bright and so I can't see what's what here at the moment yes there we go that is your you turn it um turn your bluetooth on with that button you've got your volume and your uh, your, your up volume your down volume and your, your skip as well one is uh, the pause play on the bottom there you've got Manufactured by Wismac, CE and your wheelie bin, that's fair enough. On the top there, you've got your 510 connection, and it does stick up quite a bit of a way, actually. Fairly well done. Threads down there with a the gold-plated. I believe that that is spring-loaded. Where's my... There it is. Yep, that is a spring-loaded uh, pin down there, so that's fair enough, isn't it? Turn this on. There we go. I've set it, got it set at uh, 24 at the moment. Let's... Uh, Knock it down. There we go. Oh, it's actually down to one watt. Fairly fast, all the way up to 80 watts. Right, so get into your menu system. One, two, three. And you've got wattage, bypass, temperature nickel, temperature titanium, temperature stainless steel. And one, two, three. And then back to wattage. Hold your fire button down and your plus. And you've got to turn your stealth on, fire button and plus again, and turn your stealth off. Hold both your, your regulatory buttons down together, and you get your key lock. Hold them down again, and it turns the key lock off. Turn the unit off itself. Press the regulatory buttons down together, and it switches the screen round. You do that again to turn it back to where it was. And that's basically it. It is a basic mod. Really, the, it basically what it's heralding is is the, the waterproof side of things, yeah, uh, with the cover and the switches. Anyway, you got your carabiner hook there. The five ten connection itself is as I said is raised, yeah, and the yeah, the diameter for that measures at twenty three millimeters. Yeah, that's all. That's fine. Uh, when you've got the um, the cover on although this is 25 when you've got the cover on it doesn't look quite so odd we'll put the cover back on now make sure it slips into that channel there and that's what gives you the uh, the waterproofing for the gubbins is it you can buy these rubber sleeves new colors available yeah, you've got, uh, obviously you've got this black one. Cameo, and you've got a resin type colour. Let's put this tank on it. As you can see, the uh, although it's 23, yeah, it doesn't look quite so odd. But, well, there you go. Anyway, let's go back up top and uh, give this a bit of a toot. And I'll give you my final thoughts. And we can try that speaker out on there. Yeah, see in a tick. Welcome back up. Yeah, and we've been yakking about this Wismet Active. We'll take a look at the Bluetooth speaker in a second. Let me just give this a bit of a toot. I've got that set on 30 watts at the moment. I'm actually going to knock that down a bit to... Uh, what the hell is it? Oh, there it is. To 24. There we go. Well, that's what I usually have it on. This tank 
is quite basic. It's a coil, it's a tank, and that's about all that I can actually say for it. Down that low, it is quite, it's, it's a very cool draw to it. Not my type of draw at all. Uh, let's bung it up to 50 watts. That's more like it. That's, that's, that's much more like it. The only thing is about having it up that high is the, uh, the battery, um, which is, uh, the, what, 2100 more, did I say? Yeah, 2100 mar. That height, it, it doesn't last very long at all. You do better using mouth to lung with this. Um, hence the reason, um, I, I've, I've been vaping it around about from 24 up to about 30. I'm on 45 now. That's not bad. Let's, uh, let's try something else on this, shall we? I've got the Pixie here. I'm doing a written review for EC Click. Um, I'll pop that on. It looks a bit silly because it's such a small RDA. <laughs> it looks a bit uh, bottom heavy, if you know what I mean. But I'm going to drop that down to... Where are we? About 19 watts, I think. Make sure I've got some liquid in it. Again, I've got Pink Man in it. Turn the airflow down on it. Not too bad considering it's 19 watts. Not bad at all. Let's bung it up a bit more. Get a bit of warmth into it. 25 watts. Open that airflow up slightly. The vape quality from this Pixie is much better than the um, the Alma NS Plus tank. Uh, yeah, um, I'm not one for tanks. I, anyway, what was I going to do? That's right, I was going to... Let's take that off of there. And I was going to test out that, uh, that Bluetooth speaker. Right, now, I've got to say at this point, um, I don't really see much point in using... Um, the uh, the armor, uh, sorry, the, uh, uh, the Wismec Active as a Bluetooth speaker. To me, it, 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 it's pointless. Yeah, but uh, we'll give it a go anyway. <coughs> Shut up. Uh, I'll check you out later on. Right now, um, where are we? Uh, because um, uh, YouTube can get a bit funny. On uh, on music, I'm actually allowed. I've actually been allowed to use this particular piece of music on YouTube. Um, so um, I'll, I'll I'll use that. Right. So what we do is we turn the Bluetooth speaker on. Bluetooth mode. Right. So that's just using that bottom button there. Right. Find whatever song you want to play, or whatever on your uh, mobile. Or Whatever. That's my phone. Yeah? Bluetooth connected successfully. I'm about the ears. Keep you but a minute. I'm putting my sing in there, Don, you see. There you go. That is the full volume. So Wurzel's made an appearance. Right, okay, so that's the Bluetooth speaker taken a look at. As I said, I really don't see much point in it. Let's turn this back off. That's it. Turn the speaker off. Right. Yeah, no, I don't really see much point in it. I mean, I've got my um, stereo system in the other room, my Pioneer. Um, and I've also got a iPod for playing music or even the computer so you know I, I, to be quite honest i really don't see the point in this one if you're going to use it while playing music you're going to use the use it for vaping while you is playing music your battery's going to run out really really fast on it you can't whack the what's up really high with this 
I mean, it's uh, um, an 80 watt mod, but uh, the battery just go. <laughs> It just sucks the battery life out of it, you know. Even when you're not using it for a, a, a for the for the, uh, the Bluetooth speaker. But well, there you go. I mean, innovation. They've put something in there that uh, hasn't been seen before. It's waterproof. Again, that's 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 fine. I, I'm not showing you that because, for one, I don't want. I don't personally don't want to stick this into a bucket of water. Um, other reviewers have done that in the past. As I said, I took this out in the rain. It was absolutely fine. Um, it, it worked perfectly. Yeah. Right. Let's give it another tote. That's fine. That's with that, uh, little tank on the top there, the uh, Armour NS Pro. As I said, it's a basic tank. I, I'm not real that fond of it. But there you go, that's something, that's what they've put with the kit, so there you go. Anyway, look, this has been Kevin from Whirling Vapor saying thank you very much for listening to my warblings on the... So I'll catch you guys on the next one. Let's give you a toot out. Cheers for now. Because you know I'm all about that vape, about that vape, air bubbles. I'm all about that vape, about that vape, air bubbles. I'm all about that vape, about that vape.